Hi everyone, it's uh, Simon here. It's Tuesday morning. Just wanted to show you an area of strong winds that may be causing some concern across southern parts of Ireland and southwest England during the course of uh, the next few hours. This is the chart for mid down Tuesday from our friends at weatheronline.co.uk. And this chart shows pressure, which are the isobars here that you can see, and also it shows areas of strong winds. This is mean strong winds, only model depicted, so always bear that in mind. The green colours here, where green shading is this is a 4.6 the uh, slightly lighter green shading is 4.7 and this darkest of green shading or the lightest darkest lightest darkest whatever it is is a uh, force eight winds help to gale force now watch what happens as i run the sequence through here's the time up in the top left hand corner this is the area of low pressure that's dominating things during the next few days watch what happens as we get in towards wednesday this area of stronger winds is pulling itself around the southern side of this low as the low spins around this is going to be pushing some really quite rough seas through the Bay of Biscay and up through the Channel and the southwest approaches during the course of Wednesday. However, it's during Wednesday afternoon that we see the strongest of the winds coming through as that low moves into southern parts of Ireland. So there we are. You can see the shading here showing full sevens um, coming through into southern Ireland, generally sixes for many parts of the southwest. And then through tomorrow evening, we see those areas of strong winds moving their way up the channel through the Bay of Biscay into the southern parts of the Irish Sea as the low gradually becomes absorbed into the main low across northern parts of Ireland. So we've got this spell of strong winds expected across the southwest of England. They could be up to gale force at times, particularly through the um, course of Wednesday. And um, I think it's just something you need to watch out for, particularly if you're going to be sailing in the channel, Bay of Biscay area, southern Ireland, southern Irish Sea area at all during the lap later part of Tuesday into Wednesday and uh, through into Wednesday evening and possibly even into the early hours of Thursday morning. Certainly the residual effects of that across this area south of Ireland and into the Bay uh, will be quite well felt for several days to come, um, particularly as that low, as you can see, stays over Ireland during the next few days, the flow gradually easing as we get through into the weekend and high pressure gradually starts to build. Whatever you're doing, stay safe and thanks for watching.